Hey guys, what's up? This is Ethan's Tech Show here, and we're doing a what's on my iPad. And we're gonna just get into here, so we have our basic unlock button. Slide to unlock, and let's just get into here. So when I get into my iPad, I have all my basic application, preloaded applications from Photo Booth. This is a really, very new application, so let's just show you what Photo Booth looks like on the iPad. Because you probably you haven't experienced the iPad yet, so you have your Photo Booth applications. It's just one page. You tap into it, take pictures really easily. Uh, then you have your FaceTime application that I'm not going to go into right now. So then, when we have my downloaded application, mo this is my most frequently used applications on my iPad. So first, we're going to have Calculator Pro free. This is free, so you can go off download this. So I'm just going to clear it, just a calculator because the iPad does not come with a calculator. So I went ahead and downloaded this because it's good for school and everything. Then, as we go to the side, I have a folder that has my music in it. We have iMovie and GarageBand, so let's just focus on them. So let's get into iMovie for a second. I do some of my editing on my iPad, but I don't enjoy it. It's pretty good when I'm portable. So I deleted all of them when I do them. It says it gives you a nice opening when you make a project. You just press the top button here, and it makes you a project. You can insert all you want here. I have some of my app reviews on my iPad. That's so why I usually take it for my app reviews. So that's it. And then we have GarageBand. I can I have made some songs in here that are really terrible. So that's I'm not gonna show you that, but what well, we're just gonna get into one of them. We're gonna go ahead and make one. How do we do this again? We press the plus new song. And we can pick keyboard, drums, guitar amp, auto recording, sampler, uh smart drums and then all the other stuff so I just go and I'm just going to show you the audio recorder I'm actually going to have a something later today I'm actually going to show you something later today saying uh, I when I get the opportunity to this story I will be showing you how to pull up your blue yeti up to your i computer uh, uh, iPad so you can do this so we're just going to show you how to record and we're just going to press the record button. And you're just going to hear me talk. It will start going right up there. And it will just record it. And if you want to stop it, you just press the red button again. It does take like a five bit second delay. You can listen to it by pressing the button up here. So let's just zoom into that. And you can make all this thing like small room, large room, dreamy, bullhorn. Telephone, chipmunk, robot, monster, and you can just do the game and pitch down there. So, please don't. It, it has recording when you're out of the application. Then, next, we're going to have my Twitter application. This one is free. And the, the GarageBand and uh, iMovie are four ninety nine. so it just shows me all the recent tweets. You can go into landscape mode or portrait mode. And you have your messages over here. Mentions. A list profiles you can see how many uh, followers you have then I go have my boxcar app this is free too so it's pretty cool it just shows me all my recent updates to my mail all my certified thing all my messages text show uh, my growl or IP uh, and then my stuff on my Facebook stuff there that I'm not gonna really show you then we're gonna have my end gadget here, and it just shows me uh, what's the newest stuff here. We can pick end gadget, mo i mobile, end gadget HD. End gadget HD is probably the best for it. It's meant for the iPad. End gadget's meant for the iPhone and iPod, so it just shows you all the recent stuff. I would say I go out of this. I would say uh, every <laughs> hour and check the new latest news and tweet about it. As you haven't followed me on Twitter, it's Ethan's Tech Show. And then I have this Modern Combat 2 Black Pit size. I actually play this a very lot to have multiplayer. I only play multiplayer. Uh, I have my long line. You connect to the server. My my uh, Game Loft Live thing, if you're going to go get this application, $6.99. Uh, I don't know for the iPod and iPhone. It does run on the iPhone. iPhone, you have to have Wi-Fi to play online, obviously. It shows you what rank I'm on. See, I'm on the 20th class. And... Just go ahead and add E T H A N Tech Show. That's how to get me. Then we're gonna have my Angry Birds Rio that I play a lot. I my 
I play sometimes. I'm on Jungle Escape, and it's pretty cool. Is you go in the app if you haven't had the original Angry Birds, you go in the app and you try to kill the birds. But and I'm the pigs in the original Angry Birds, but it's birds in this one. It also shows you your high score and everything else. So we're also going to get into Live View. This is another application that lets me show what's on my computer screen to my iPad. But I'm not going to connect it today. I might do a later app review when I jailbreak this. So it might be a little easier. Uh, so I have my Toontastic here. This is the next application. This is running two ninety nine, And it's awesome. Uh, you can make your, like, your own comic strip with, with speaking and moving your characters. Uh, you have like all these characters. You can make your own background by coloring, uh, Photoshop and stuff. You could download your own applications. It gives you a nice opening. It has your create a cartoon. I actually have done some. So you just press new cartoon. Let's create a cartoon. And it gives you like a story act setup, conflict, challenge, climax. If you ever been in, like if in younger grades you used to do that, like what the climax and stuff. So it's pretty cool. Uh, this is this section here with what's on my iPad. Peace, guys. Make sure to subscribe, comment, and rate for all your tech info.